Hello friends, I am super excited to be here to share with you a walkthrough of the holiday kits coming to the paper person shop. And I'm especially excited because I'm sure as with a lot of you, when Kelly Perky announced that she was closing her Kelly Perky shop, I was like many of you, super upset. I just love Kelly's aesthetic and the way she designs products and so I am thrilled, beyond thrilled, that she's back with a new venture called The Paper Person Shop, and she is starting it off with a bang with a new kit, subscription kit, and holiday kits. These kits go on sale tomorrow at noon Eastern time, 10, uh, excuse me, 10 a.m. Eastern time. If you have a subscription already for the October kit, you can shop a couple of hours early. So uh, everything here that you're gonna see will be on sale for the public uh, tomorrow at noon Eastern time. So this is a look at the A Little Christmas Black and White kit. There are two versions of this kit. One, as you see here, is black, white, and red, and then the other has bits of color in it. So I'm gonna go over all of the kits and all of the stamps, so let's get started. Okay, first up we have the papers for this kit. Now one thing that's new this time around for Kelly and her kit products is she is doing all of the papers on 12 by 12. Now I know that there was maybe some questions people might have like what is the paperweight gonna be like since it's a 12 by 12 sheet? Well, I just wanted to let you know that this is a cardstock weight. This is not a traditional scrapbook paper weight. This is the same exact weight of paper that Kelly used to put out all of her pocket page cards, her traveler's notebook kit cards, all of it. It's the exact same weight. Now these are double-sided and you'll see on this kit there are two six by eights and then four three by fours on the bottom. And I just love how she's done this kit. I mean, things like this that are so perfect for 2020. And then on the back are graphics that she designed. Uh, you can either use the back or you can use it double-sided. So I love that one. Here's another one. I love this plaid, the, pa the presents on the back. Now this paper is, you flip it over and it's reversed. So the plaid has the packages, the packages has the plaid. And then you get additional cards down here. And then there is this sheet. Great, I love this. And then a plain black and white stripe on the back. And then this sheet. I love that she brought the holiday checklist back. I put that in my December daily album last year right up at the front and I kept track of all the dates and filled it in. So that was a fun way to keep track of all those fun things. <laughs> this is funny. And then on the back, you have a black and white version of the two Santas, which is super cute. Included in the kit are also some additional papers from, it looks like mostly American Crafts brands. So this notes paper, this cute heart paper, a map paper, this pretty wave, and then this sheet of vellum with numbers on it. So those are all of the big papers for that black and white kit. And then here are some of the fun other things. So Kelly did another letterpress sheet for numbers and I love these tickets. I wasn't sure how I was going to number my pages this year for my December daily. So I absolutely love this. Um, I like that they're small and they won't take up too much space. And then I love that you have these additional tickets that you can use to cluster or whatever. And so it has the number and then the written out number day. So I absolutely love this. The thing that I'm most excited about is puffy stickers. I've asked Kelly for a really long time if she could do puffy stickers like this, so I am thrilled that she is doing them. I hope this isn't here. Let me turn this over so there's hopefully not so much glare. Hopefully that's okay. But I love these puffy stickers, and I know I'm going to use them all. especially love these little hearts and stars, and of course, the two different Santa versions. I just think they're fantastic. So there's that. Um, these are chip, they're, it's not chipboard, it's a thick paper. So they have no dimension whatsoever, except for like if you were sticking a sheet of paper, a three by four card on top of a backing page. So these are not as thick as chipboard which is fantastic because they won't add bulk. So if you're doing like a three by eight or a traveler's notebook size December daily and you're concerned about the space because those rings have 
um, you have a smaller amount of, um, the ring size is smaller in those albums. These are gonna be fantastic because they will add zero bulk to your project. Kelly also included a holographic alpha. This is from American Crafts. She also included these amazing red number stickers. This is a six by 12 sheet of numbers and there's plenty of ones, plenty of twos, and plenty of fives to use for throughout the entire month for your December daily, which is fantastic. And then a six by 12 sheet of her classic letter sticker. And again, because it's bigger than the previous six by eight size, you're getting a ton of letters in here. So that's awesome. And then she also included a couple of washi tapes in this kit. One says ho, 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 and one is a candy stripe, which is super cute. And then lastly, she made die cuts, which is the direct line to my heart. So I just love these. I love the Santa with the mask, the cocoa, a little gingerbread dude, some holly, another Santa, red tree, the deer, Rudolph, because he's got a red nose, so cute. Snowman, a um, little drummer man, super cute. A tree and then a sweater. So that is everything in the A Little Christmas black and white kit. And next up, I'm gonna show you what the color version of this kit looks like. It's a little bit different, so hold on for that. Okay, here we are with the A Little Christmas kit with the color version. Now this kit is super similar to the black and white version, but as you can see here, the colors are a little bit more traditional. There's some lovely greens, a really pretty navy, few pops of pink. So let's get started with a walkthrough of this kit. Okay, so here are the cards and papers for the color version of A Little Christmas. A same format, six by eight papers up top and four by three by four cards on the bottom. And these reverse to the same pattern that was on the other kit, but this has color in it, red and then the pretty green. And I just love this pattern. Again, there's presents, but these time, this time they are color and then the plaid. And then I just love these uh, paint swatch type cards. Those are so pretty. And then this one has a dark green background with black and it says things like hands off, look but don't touch, step back buddy. So it's all about like don't open until Christmas kind of sentiments, which is super cute. And then here's another paper. This is so pretty. Um, a list card, I love these. And then a stripe. And then again, the checklist again, this background is really pretty. Another COVID. And then the colorful version of the Santa faces, which is fantastic. And then these are the American Crafts papers that were included in this kit. Really pretty colors. I love this navy and this green stripe is awesome. And then this kit also includes a gold vellum, which is super pretty. This kit also includes the exact same letterpress sheet. Um, no difference whatsoever, same exact letterpress. So this is great because if you do end up getting the black and white and the colored kit, you're gonna get two of these. So you can save one for next year, or if you're making two albums, one to gift, you will have a duplicate of this, which is fantastic. You will also get the same paper stickers and the same red sheet of numbers but this kit differs by giving you a light blue letter or alpha sticker sheet and these i didn't mention but these do have numbers on it and then this one also includes a gold puffy uh alpha from american crafts and this has the same like light blue side that this letter has so those are really cool and this does have numbers i can't confirm whether this is enough to to number your entire album, but there are numbers for different options. And then it has a sheet of the puppy stickers. I believe this is exactly the same. And then here's a look at the chipboard, the snowman. It's the exact same items, just colored in a different fun and festive way. I think it would be cute to use both, like the black and white version and the color version and kind of have them tucked behind. And then there is washi tape, a stripe, and a holly. So that is a look at A Little Christmas, the color version. Okay, here we have a look at the Merry Merry kit. And I really, really love this kit. The 
illustrations are phenomenal. And you will notice right off the bat that this differs than the other kit because these pages are three by eight instead of six by eight. So let's take a look at these amazing illustrations in the Mary Mary kit. Okay, first up we have this sheet of paper. I love these Nutcracker-esque illustrations. They are just so beautiful and I really love this cluster here on this card. So these are gonna be fantastic to either use in three by eight protectors or just punch holes and slip them right into your album. On the reverse, you have a Mary Mary print in green, which is a really pretty color. This page, oh my gosh, it's so fantastic. So if you go to the Nutcracker every year with your family or your daughter, and even this year, if you're not gonna be able to see it in person, but you still watch it on TV, this is gonna be the best kit to document your love of the Nutcracker during the holiday season. And I just think it's fantastic. And I really think it would be fun this year to find a really great um, film or DVD or whatever that you can watch for the season and document that for one of your ideas for your day. I'm sure there's some fantastic versions out there that you can watch. Um, so that's a great idea to how to incorporate this kit into your plans for December. This joy is fantastic. And I love these tickets. And then on the back is a really pretty red and gold stripe. And then these are some American Crafts papers that are included in this kit just to tie into the pretty colors. This window pane is really lovely and this blue is really lovely. And then also included in this kit is a stamp set. The A Little Christmas black and white and colors uh, kits do not have stamps. So this is a great stamp set. I love these Decembers where you have a space to leave words and then Kelly has added little um, sayings that will fit right in that space. So this is a beautiful stamp set. I love the Nutcracker and then he has um, or she that she made different little pieces to color in his uniform there. It's fantastic. A really great floral poinsettia and holly washi tape. Here are some more of the paper stickers. These are all really pretty. I love the colors. I love that candle. A navy blue letter set. A white sheet of number stickers, similar to the red one that... Um, that was in the other kit. And then there is also a really pretty script gold um, alpha chipboard set, or I think these are more puffy than chipboard, uh, letter set to go in this kit. So that is a look at Mary Mary. Okay, now we have a look at the Stink Stank Stunk kit, which I think is a hilarious name for a holiday kit. Um, as you can see, the colors are a mix between traditional and then some maybe non-traditional colors, which is fantastic. I love this burnt umber color mixed with the pink, I think, and the red and the blue. It's just fantastic. It's very indicative of color combinations that Kelly has always put in her kits, and I think it's great. So let's take a look at this kit at the 12 by 12 papers that Kelly designed for this kit. And I love that this kit has four by six cards in it. Um, this sheet is all four by six cards. And then on the other side is a really cute um, can image. These are hilarious. I haven't looked at this kit yet, so I'm seeing it for the first time. That's that's funny. Um, here is another sheet of four by six papers. I love the Christmas crackers and I love this uh, black and white tree print. That's awesome. Oh, and here is a whole sheet of three by four cards. I'm just reading these. I love this. Do not disturb until 2021. That's relatable. So that is an awesome, awesome sheet of three by four cards. That's great. And then this kit also has additional um, 12 by 12 papers from American Crafts, a ticket, this really pretty red, this pink, and then, <clears throat> excuse me, the Hey Santa vellum that I know is sold out everywhere. So super excited to get this in this kit. This kit also includes a stamp set and it has some really great sentiments. Um, if you're not super into the holidays, this is a good stamp set for you. A difficult December, which I know for a lot of people, it can be extremely difficult. And I have a feeling that this year with everything the way it is, things might not be all rosy. So that is a really good stamp. Um, of course, the cocktail glasses, the wine bottles, um, the Festivus pole, 
this amazing tree with a pattern that you can stamp on. I just think that's fantastic. This kit also has extra large shipping tags. It looks like, oh, these are super thick. The uh, two white. Um, the number stickers for this kit are such an amazing font. This is really cool. And it was on one of the papers. So that's really cool. Here are the paper stickers to go along with this. Canceled. A trying to be Mary. Um, that's great. And then there is a sheet of white alpha and then a pretty um, forest green and blue like plaid type washi tape. So that is the Stink Stank Stunk Kit. Last but not least, we have the Twinkle Traveler's Notebook sized kit. And this was designed by Tina Asmus of Life Love Paper. So it's really great to have her designs back again um, with Kelly in the paper person shop. This kit um, is very indicative of Tina's style and the patterns on the cards are just super, super cute. So let's take a look. So here is a look at the Traveler's Notebook papers. Tina always does such an amazing job with her hand-drawn graphics for her kits. And I just think this is so sweet with the mugs, the socks, the stars, the trees. It's just adorable. These papers are double-sided, so I'm going to go ahead and flip them over as I go through them so you can see what's on the back. This one has a fill-in-the-blank style of card, which is great. This is a fantastic cursive typewriter, kind of just word background, which I know I would use. And then another version of that. Here's a pink, cute green, black and white trees, pretty watercolor background, some splotches, another fill in the blank, cute Christmas socks, and more Christmas socks. So those are the cards. There's also a stamp set for this kit where you can build your own Christmas trees and make some Christmas socks, which is super cute. There are, oops, I just peeled off a star. There are some labels, these amazing blue shipping tags. Here are some paper stickers for this kit. These are all so cute. I love these colorful stars. Very cute. And then another version of the alphabet, but in a really pretty blue that, gosh, it almost matches that exactly. Those are really great. And then a cute little snowball washi tape with little kids on it. That's really cute. So that is the Twinkle Traveler's Notebook Kit from Life Love Paper. Next up, I wanted to share with you the stamp sets that are being released for the launch tomorrow. There are quite a few of them, as you can see. So let's start with the six by eight size. This is the um, Highline Phrase. Let me move this. This is the Highline Phrases, which are fantastic. These are going to be great to, to stamp on the bottom of a page, across a tag. You can emboss. These are fantastic for embossing. You can also stamp them and then outline them if you have a foil quill. There's so many options with this stamp set. She is also re-releasing the Highline Months and the Highline Days of the Week. These I had previously, so that's why they look used. I've already used these. And then the Days of the Week. And this also has really great numbers. If you wanted to stamp your own numbers, you can pick up this for that. Here is another new number set, Alberta. This is the solid, and then this is the outline. So you can stamp over it, um, solid color at black, whatever you want. These are again gonna be great to emboss because of the, all the surface area. It's a great stamp set. This is a stamp set for the warm weather folks. It's all about, you know, having, you know, sunshine. I do love this Santa with the sunglasses though. He's fantastic. Here is a stamp set about baking day and she brought the butter back from last year, which is awesome. I think that's cool. This is all about home. I love this wreath, so pretty, follow law. This is so great, I love these stamps. Um, these are like postage stamps, so you have a back to fill in solid um, for both sizes, or you can just stamp them black and white or in a color, they're really great, love the stamps. Here is just a sentiment stamp with a Christmas cracker, which is awesome. Um, these little words, again, will fit into here. So that is a really great stamp set. The snow globes, so cute. 
you can create your own little scene. I love that. And last but not least, um, the Amelia alphabet stamp. So that is a look at all of the stamps and I hope you loved seeing everything in person and I hope you um, get everything that you want to get and I will be back online tomorrow with the project that I am making with the kits that are being released that are not holiday. So watch out for that in my feed and I will be sharing a giveaway opportunity. So make sure you Tune in for that and participate in that if you're looking to win a one of these kits. So I hope to see you back and thanks again and I'll see you back really soon. Take care. Bye.